What up, Long Beach? Welcome back to the 562.org. It's Tyler. And Mike, and this high school volleyball video is brought to you by Naples Rib Company. We're at Lakewood, the number three ranked team in California. The Lakewood Lancers have been terrific this year, unbeaten in league play. Senior Laura Williams, headed to Oregon State, has been helping the Lancers uh, towards a more league title, trying to take a big step forward tonight. Megan Moanoa knows this gym well, former Lancer leading her Jackrabbits into Lakewood for the first time. Adanya Faumuina, their number one, has been hurt all year, but is playing. Unfortunately for Polly, their other USC commit, Riley McGinnis, still in street clothes and a boot. Not good. Well, uh, for Lakewood, wasting absolutely no time going to L. Dub Williams with the kill to open the match. And then Samara say, who? Samara Deku finding the hole in the block. Then it's balls to the halls. Fatima and Kiki, do you roof me? Lakewood up 10-3 in the first. Lancer's just in a great rhythm early and a great first set for Deku as we see two of her eight kills in the match for number 17. Uh, Lancer's definitely came out proving a point in set one. Well, they just have a lot of kids who hoop, Tyler, but Polly does too. <laughs> they got settled in thanks to this solo roof by young Haley McGinnis. Oh my, one of two solo blocks for Sixer. But the Jackrabbits uh, couldn't quite get back into it. They played even late in the set, but the lead was too big as Epps and then Williams both had kills. And then Lakewood winning it comfortably as Fatima Hall goes over on two. 25-14 in set one. And the Lancers are dancers, Mike. The Jackrabbits still looking for answers. Second set, <laughs> Lakewood controlling the net. Kiki Hall is everywhere and finally gets the slam dunk kill. She was uh, all over the overpass. Uh, yeah, she's going to turn this overpass into a structure fire, Mike. She had a match high 10 kills on 692 hitting. Yeah, that's pretty good. Lancer's also spreading it around. Epps with five kills in the middle. And Shayna Martinez on the outside. She had eight kills and also hit over 600. On set points, the Williams ace is going to give Lakewood a dominant 25-12 win in set two as they're looking for another more league sweep. This team has swept their last 10 in a row and have not lost a set in league play. Apali much better in set three. Falmoina sets up McGinnis for an off the heezy. It's 10 to 10 in set three, but Lakewood still a strong block led by Hall who had a game high five roofs. This is a 5-0 run to put Lakewood up 15-10, but would Polly go quietly? Faumui na! A new day Adanying with uh, the back row fireball, one of her six kills, and then Meredith Houston putting one down as the Jackrabbits hanging tough in set three. But were the Lancers stressed? Nah, Deku, <laughs> Samara with a pair of kills here to keep Lakewood in front as the Lancers just looked composed. Back and forth, the teams went. Adanya sets up Haley for one of her five kills. She also had three aces, did the sophomore, and really impressive player for the green and gold. But Lakewood always had the answer, Mike. Yeah, Williams with their ninth kill right here also had four blocks and eight digs. And on set point, it's going to be Martinez forcing it through the block. Lancers, another sweep, their 11th straight win. And one step closer to that more league title, it will be their first in four years. Uh, but they're certainly looking very good for it at this point. The Jackrabbits have a rematch with Milliken next Thursday. Lakewood hosting Mayfair Saturday in the Steve Lewis Volley Fest. And we'll see you there. I want to thank all of our sponsors, including Ocean Law Center, for their support of local sports coverage. And if you want to keep up with Lakewood, Polly, and the rest of Morley Girls Volleyball, you know you got to keep it locked right here at the 562.org.